Hello everyone. Today I would like to show you how to identify the biological activities of every compound uh, using the PASS online. Uh, in this study, I uh, identify the promising inhibitory uh, heterocyclic compounds again the acetylcholine etera enzyme using the Quishak model and ADMET and BioTVD. Uh, in, in here I identify around uh, identify around three compounds and you can see in the figure here uh, in this figure here I identify around three compounds compound 25 compound 113 and compound 114 uh, at, at you can see here the com compound um, 25 here they uh, can cross the blood brain barrier and they can absorb in the human intestinal it is very very pro uh, promising compound right but uh, in here I also uh, identify all another um, compounds uh, they also uh, absorb in the human intestinal uh, but they cannot cross the blood brain barrier so now I I want to identify the bioactivities uh, between the compounds uh, because in this study I identify the acetylcholine etera so I need to compare with the donepazil the, the, the FDA approval drug uh, so uh, in this uh, video I will show you how to make the table like that uh, the first one is I have uh, as I mentioned before right? I have three compounds right and it is my of these compounds so uh, in here you uh, go back to the uh, my paper here and you click to the uh, pass online here and you click here and they you allow uh, after that they will show you the uh, website like that because I, I already you know uh, I, I will will uh, make the detail one because in here I already you know uh, register right I you need to register you know to get the access in this website and I here I already just uh, you if you don't have the account you need to register and you need to enter here so after that they will ask you uh, uh, in here you can uh, go home and you can see you know a lot of information about how they uh, conduct you know the bioactivity right in here they said that fast online predict around 4,000 kind of bioactivities enzyme adverse effects and influence of gene everything here right and you can read more information about this website here right so in this video I don't want to mention about that uh, so in here I want to predict a new compound and I click the new read the new compound uh, because uh, my uh, I already have smile as I mentioned before right so I click smile and in here I will you know copy my smile the first one I I will copy the compound uh, 20, uh, 20, uh, 27, uh, 25. I, I insert in here and I get prediction. After that, they will show you the bioactivity of you know um, of your compound. As you can see here, uh, the first time if you choose all here, it means that they will show you the the PA here. It means that the uh, predict prediction of activities. PI here is it means that prediction of inhibition and here they show you the activity and um, if you choose the all here it means that they will show you the whole information if you choose here it means that you know PI uh, uh, prediction of activity is more than uh, rather than the uh, prediction of inhibition or if you want to uh, select the uh, uh, prediction of activity more than 30 percent or the prediction of activity more than 70 percent uh, if you do you so but in here I refer to choose the old one and after that you can click OK here and they show you the whole result right after that you only copy uh, you want if you want to copy you need to um, copy you know the whole one here and you can copy here and you go to the Excel file and in here I already copy and you page you can pay here and as you can see the similar with my result right so in here I will uh, remove a little bit uh, because I want to use the uh, velop cook so that's why I want to move the 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 activities in the first column like that so in here I have the similar with my uh, my previous uh, repair right so in here I don't want to repeat again and I delete it uh, so uh, uh, 
um, go back to the um, the the website and you can see here they also mention about the um, toxic effect or adverse effects of the compound because the compound only not only have the bioactivity but also they also show the uh, negative effects or we call adverse effect or toxic effects in here if you want to uh, further study you can copy one uh, as you can see here they said that you know the compound they have around um, 73 percent they can you know uh, call you know um, hypotension it means that low uh, blood pressure uh, around 67 percent they have the hyper to lemmix some kind of thing like that so but in here i i don't want to focus on the adverse adverse or toxic effects i only focus on the bioactivity so i only copy the uh, the data from the bioactivity uh, as i mentioned here and so after that you did similar with you know compound you know um, compound you know 113 and compound uh, 100 and you know um, 14 so after that i have Mm, uh, I also did with you know donepazil, did the uh, reference drugs, uh, the FDA approval drug, and after that you, if you want to uh, 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 make the table like me here, uh, you at uh, the, uh, the first time you need to look at your purpose of this, uh, your study, right? In here I, as I mentioned before, right, my study is you know focused on the um, Acetinsulin etteras. So that's why in here I will uh, identify the identify the bio bioactivities related to the acetinsulin etera. So in here the first one I go to the donepazil because donepazil is the relevant drugs. So I here I will solve with you know cho acetinsulin you know acetinsulin acetin right acetinsulin you know acetinsulin right acet Acetinsulin, right? Let me see. I say, uh, yeah, I so, uh, you know, I, and here I will, you know, talk every words about the acetinsulin, you know, uh, etc. And you can see here they have a lot of, you know, uh, uh, the keywords um, related to the acetinsulin, etc. Right? So after that, I um, I refer to two, you know, acetinsulin, etc. Uh, uh, neuromuscular blocking agent and copy here and I, after that I will um, pay here right or because cholinectrix is also related to the acetinsulin so um, I also you know find thing in here you can see I, I will find here and I found that you know cholinectrix we have two uh, five cholinectrix right cholinectrix and cholinectrix antagonics some kind of thing like that so uh, up to your you know um, um, purpose you can identify the law of bioactivity related to your um, purpose in here i select the cholinectric acetinsulin uh, neuromuscular acetinsulin release uh, stimulants and dementia treatment cognitive disorder treatment anti-inflammatory um amylid beta you know pre-secure um i also identify not the one you know apoptosis antagonic uh, or Cholinectrix and uh, antagonic or everything related to you know uh, acetinsulin etc uh, for Alzheimer treatment. So after that, you know I will you know um, uh, use the the keyword is velocup right? You mean some four right? Velocup and I choose the you know the first the let me see here. Uh, so you a little bit the velocup. And I choose the A3. It means that you know the keyword you want to uh, looking for, right? And uh, in here I will choose the whole table uh, from the you know uh, number um, the column A to the column C, as you can see here. And after that, you know I choose the um, um, because I only uh, focus on the uh, prediction of activity. So in here I will select the column number two, and you can see here. And I have that I have the result like that. Right, I have a result like that. Uh, similar with you know compound twenty five, compound uh, one hundred and thirteen, and compound one hundred fourteen. You did the similar with that. Only change the you know the the data in here. I you can see I change the data you know from the A three or um, uh, data from the you know C one or uh, data from the C five or data from the C um, you know C six. 
so after that you know you can you know uh, remove the you know um, uh, the data with you know no you know information and let me see here again why they don't so like that I will did uh, for you the compile here right? very look up very look up yeah, very look up here and I choose here either my keywords and here I show the you know the my table right and I only want one two I F four because I want to fix it and I choose the um, prediction of activity the column number two and the I want to exact you know uh, detail one and so I choose the zero and after that I have a data like that that you can see here this is the information my information right because in here as you can see uh, why they show the NA it needed no answer right so I don't want to show this answer uh, this information so I copy in here I copy to another a table in here uh, I copy to the no, no table in here and I re delete the whole you know um, uh, the missing information and after that I have the whole information I I want to uh, public uh, my data so after that because here they said that the prediction you know but in here they also show you the uh, uh, we need to uh, multiple with 100% to show that the percentage in here I I refer to uh, result the percentage of you know activity so uh, in here I the first time I I, I name the column the, the variable bioactivities and here I show the whole information I want to public and here I said that you know truly you know predict uh, prediction of activity percentage so that's why I multiple with 100% as you can see here uh, Donate Donate Brazil they uh, they they are uh, belong to you know Chilean grids because they when they will you know activate the stimulator acetyl choline to you know connect uh, to transfer uh, the information to another uh, from one neuron to another neuron and in here Donate Brazil also have the high you know prediction for acetyl choline uh, neuromuscular uh, blocking agent because uh, and here also that you know they also predict that you know acetin, uh, dopamine Brazil also have uh, prediction for acetylcholine release stimulant uh, release stimulants and um, similar with that I found that you know the compound 25 here uh, have similar uh, bioactivity with the donor Brazil and uh, because donor Brazil is FDA approval it means that preference drug it means that the compound 25 here have similar uh, bioactivity um, with donor Brazil uh, uh, compared with you know the compound ten, uh, 14 and um, 13 and 14 uh, you can see here they have uh, less you know bioactivity compared with 20, 25 and have they have here they also have similar uh, have um, a few activity like anti-inflammatory effects or amylid beta precursor protein antigenic here is okay but they uh, we, we need to compare with prevalent drugs uh, so in here uh, let's like, look back again here I saw my old information in my table number four here and I check with you know the uh, pharmacokinetics of the compound you can see here as I mentioned before right compound 20, uh, 25 here they can cross the blood brain barrier they can observe in the um, tetra intestinal here a more important one here in non pike uh, lycoprotein it means that when they cross to the the brain and the brain did not remove them it is very potential for uh, brain treatment especially Alzheimer's disease uh, next one I will show you the uh, ADMT, uh, ADMT here. I will make the not slide and uh, videos to show you how to conduct the ADMT for the potential compound, right? Uh, so in this video, I will um, uh, show you how to identify the bio biological activities of every compound. You only use mine, and you can conduct uh, bio activities of every compound you want. Uh, only use um, the smile and with the breeze web uh, website before pass online uh, I hope this video will help you to figure out how to uh, uh, identify bio activities uh, with every compound uh, with breeze uh, software uh, thank you for your watching